It's been two days since victims of the Goza bomb attacks were brought to the state specialist hospital, Maiduguri. Today, the vice president, Kashim Shetima, is here alongside top government officials in the state to see how the victims are recovering. He personally interacted with the patients here. The vice president is clearly saddened by the incident and assured of the federal government's support to take care of the victims. The House of President Bola Amatinebu is with the victims and he specifically instructed us to come and offer our condolences and commiserations to the victims of this incident. We are here with the Director General of NEMA and the Acting Governor I've been working around the clock to provide succor and support to the victims. The vice president disclosed that about 32 deaths have been recorded from the attack. So far we have recorded 32 deaths and I want to use this forum to most sincerely register our profound gratitude to the Borno State Government, to National Emergency Management Agency NEMA, and the State Emergency Management Agency and ICRC for rising up to the challenges of the times and giving their best. The VP is short of plans by the Tinubu led government of a stalled future occurrence and guarantee the safety of lives and property. At the moment, the death toll has risen to over 30. 16 were discharged, while 26 are responding to treatment. Normal C has since returned to Goza town with security operatives on patrol and residents going about their lawful business. Jesse Tafida, TVC News, Maiduguri.